On the Doloa continent, there exists a creature called Gu, this kind of organism is very powerful, and its effects can also be said to be comprehensive, the person who controls the Gu insect is a Gu master. And Song Wentong is one of the few, even the only, Gu master on the Doloa continent. Dragon Power Gu, Iron Skin Gu, Bamboo Gentleman Gu, Thunder Gu, Wing Gu, Diamond Gu, Spring and Autumn Cicada, these unique Gu insects one after another, will be carried forward in the hands of Song Wentong. Ning Rongrong said, Please, I really know I was wrong. Don't punish me with the heart-piercing Gu anymore. I really know I was wrong. Qian Renxue said, Tell me, have you bewitched me with love? Yi Lingling. I don't want to cultivate soul power and become a soul master anymore. Can I teach you how to control Gu insects? I want to become a Gu master. Tang San. Gu Shir, what's the difference between us and evil soul Shir? Song went on, Tang San and you are at odds. Song went on said, are you a petty thief who steals the inner martial arts of the sect and is at odds with me? Are you also worthy? Tang San, reveal all your secrets. In front of the bamboo gentleman, you can say you don't have to panic. Keywords of the novel Doluo I, the supreme master of Gu Dao, all enemies in the world. Without a pop dot up window, Doluo I, the supreme master of Gu Dao, am an enemy in the world. Download the complete set of TXT, Doluo I, the supreme master of Gu Dao, are all enemies in the world. Latest Chapter Reading Chapter 1 The Battle of Phoenix-Tailed Cocktail Snake, Song Went On of Twin Martial Souls You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 1 The Battle of Phoenix-Tailed Cocktail Snake, Song Went On of Twin Martial Souls Dolua Continent, Starry Forest Sister Chow, as I said, we are determined to win this Phoenix-Tailed Cocktail Snake at Shrek Academy. So, please give way to me, Sister Chow. When Zhao Wuji spoke these words, he had an obvious apologetic smile on his face. On the surface, Zhao Wuji is apologizing, but in reality, but his heart was filled with disdain. Just kidding, Dai Mubai, one of the Shrek Seven Monsters, is the Prince of Star Luo, Ning Rongrong is the Seven Treasures and Thousand Gold, and Tang San's father is the world. Renowned Haotian Dolua Tang Hao. So, can they return the phoenix tail cocktail crown snake? Can we hand it over? Of course not. Meanwhile, if it weren't for worrying about Dragon Lord being around here, so Zhao Wuji may have already taken action to slay the ancestors and grandchildren in front of him here, and implemented silence. Upon hearing Zhao Wuji's words, Snake Lady Chao Tian Xiang was also very angry and annoyed. You should know that she finally found a soul beast like the phoenix-tailed cocktail snake, which was suitable for being the soul ring of her granddaughter Meng Still. At the same time, it took her a lot of effort and effort to beat it seriously, but what happened in the end? And finally. But it was effortlessly taken away by someone. Just snatch it away and take it away, not even returning it to them. So this Shrek Academy is really a bit shameless. It is precisely because of these reasons, or rather, these reasons, that, if Snake Lady Chao Tian Xiang is not angry or angry, then it's really strange. With a fixed gaze and a locked gaze, Zhao, are you sure you want to do such an inhumane thing, said the snake witch, who gritted her teeth and clenched her snake cane after the words of Snake Lady Kaoxiang Xiang fell, without waiting for Zhao Wuji to speak up and give a response, Ning Rongrong interjected and said, Snake Lady Chao Tian Fragrance Senior, right? I am from the Seven Treasure Glass Sect. The leader of the Seven Treasure Glass Sect, Ning Fengji, is my father. Take this token and go to the Seven Treasure Glass Sect to explain the situation. I believe my father will send someone to search for a new soul ring for you. As for this phoenix tailed coxcomb snake, we will take it. After saying these words, Ning Rongrong took out a token from the storage soul guide he carried with him, immediately after, without saying a word, she threw it directly to the snake woman, when throwing it away, Ning Rongrong had a casual and proud expression on his face, 
without any respect. Not only that, but also, when Ning Rongrong spoke, she just looks at people through her nostrils, she even called out the name of the old senior snake lady Kaoshiangxiang, and this was a clear way to not give snake lady face. But it's normal to think about it, after all, who is Ning Rongrong? She is the daughter of the Seven Treasures Glass Sect, she is Ning Fengji's only daughter, it is the Pearl and the Palm of Dolua, the two major titles of Sword Bone, so, does she need to respect the Snake Lady? Do you need to give face to Snake Lady? In terms of identity, Ning Rongrong really doesn't need it. After Ning Rongrong finished speaking, Zhao Wuji replied with an obvious playful smile, it seems that I need to trouble you to go to the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect with my elder sister. Zhao Wuji's meaning is very obvious, that's because if the phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake doesn't return it, and he really did this shameless and inhumane thing. In Zhao Wuji's view, since Ning Rongrong reported her identity, so it's time for snake lady Chao Tian Xiang to take a step back, after all, in today's Dolua continent, apart from the martial soul hall, the majestic Haokin sect, and the blue electric Tyrannosaurus Rex family, there is no force that dares to offend the Seven Treasures Glass Sect, which claims to be wealthy and invincible. Facing Zhao Wuji, who is known as the Soul Saint and the Immovable Ming King, and can freely come and go among the armies, faced with Ning Rongrong, the daughter of the Seven Treasures Glass Sect, to be honest, Snake Lady Kaoxiangxiang was unable to compete in both strength and identity, so she reluctantly tightened her snake cane in her hand. Grandma, let's go. My brother once said, keep the green mountains here, you're not afraid of not having firewood to burn. There are still many soul beasts in this starry forest, let's search for them. Seeing that the situation is not good, Meng still immediately spoke up and made a decision. Meng still decided to give up the good soul ring of the phoenix-tailed cocktail snake to ensure the safety of her and her grandmother. After Meng still fell silent, Ma Hongjun, one of the Shrek's seven monsters with red hair and a very bulky and obese figure, immediately spoke up and said, isn't it good to be like this earlier? We must waste our precious time here. Now, hurry up and leave, don't delay our Shao Ao's absorption of soul rings. Ma Hongjun is such a person, as long as he gains power, he will be extremely arrogant and domineering, with an unparalleled aura. Also at this time, a voice rang out with ease, escaped into the ears of everyone at the scene, still, still, still. My brother told you that staying in the green mountains is not afraid of burning firewood, but I remember he also told you that taking a step back, the more you think, the more angry you become, and enduring it for a while, the more you think, the more you lose, right? Listening to this familiar voice, after repeatedly confirming that I was not mistaken, Snake Lady Kaoxiangxiang and her granddaughter Meng still seemed to see the dawn of hope and despair, and their eyes lit up unconsciously, revealing a joyful expression. Looking for the direction of the sound, everyone saw this person. That person has a very tall figure, about 1.86 meters tall. His shoulders are very broad, and he is very handsome with a jade-like face. In his handsome face, he is full of the toughness unique to a real man. At the center of the person's eyebrows, there are two small red dots. That person has abnormal pupils, with red and yellow eyes, overall, it gives people a very strange feeling. That person was dressed in a luxurious robe, with an extraordinary and extraordinary temperament. In the crowd, he must be the most prominent one, and it is not an exaggeration to say that he stands out from the crowd. This person is none other than Meng Still's brother Song Wentong. Why is Meng Still's brother surnamed Song? Because he was picked up by Snake Pony and Dragon Lord. Song Wentong, it's a traveler from Aqua Blue Star, he is a traveler familiar with all the secrets of Dolua Continent. When he crossed the Dolua Continent, he was still a baby in swaddling clothes. In the war, he should have died, but he was kindly adopted by the Snake Snake Dragon Lord and raised to adulthood. At the age of six, Song Wentong awakens his martial soul, he possesses two martial souls with innate soul power. First martial soul, weapon martial soul, listen to the wind blade. An absolute fast knife with ultimate wind attributes. Second martial soul, beast martial soul, 
swallowing Dragon Mang. Simply put, it's a python that can swallow real dragons. Although Song Wentong's second martial soul is a python, but it's a python that specializes in eating real dragons. In addition, Song Wentong also has a Gu Shen system and a Gu master identity. Looking at Song Wentong, it seemed that something was wrong. An obvious solemn expression appeared in his eyes, and Zhao Wuji, who had become serious and serious, also spoke up and said to Shrek Seven behind him, Little monsters, be careful, this person is not easy. After saying these words, Zhao Wuji is also well prepared to engage in a major battle at any time. Zhao Wuji's experienced intuition told him that, the young people in front of me are not ordinary people, it's best not to provoke him, but also to stay away from him. Otherwise, the consequences will inevitably be very serious. And it is very likely that Zhao Wuji cannot afford it. Looking at Song Wentong in front of me, Zhao Wuji also suddenly remembered the person he met the other day, intuition tells Zhao Wuji that the person in front of him is just as terrifying as the person he met the other day. It's equally terrifying. As for who that person is. I can only say that I understand everything. Upon hearing Zhao Wuji's words, after repeatedly confirming that I didn't hear anything wrong, Dai Mubai was also momentarily stunned. After Dai Mubai glanced at Song Wentong a few times, with his eyebrows and eyes tightly locked, he immediately spoke up, Teacher Zhao, are you? Are you sure he's not simple? Judging from his appearance, he's only four or five years older than me, in his twenties, and at most, he's just a soul sect or even a soul king powerhouse. And you're a great soul saint. When speaking these words, Dai Mubai's heart was filled with disbelief and doubt. In his twenties, he was able to make the motionless Ming King Zhao Wuji, who came and went freely among the armies, feel that it was not easy. So, what kind of divine is Song Wentong? P.S. Canon New Book, Seeking the Support of All Readers End of this chapter Chapter 2 Dai Mubai's Anger and Ning Rongrong's Thoughts, Seeking Support You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 2 Dai Mubai's Anger and Ning Rongrong's Thoughts, Seeking Support Phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake, ours. After glancing at the crowd at Shrek Academy and then at the dying phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake on the ground, Song went on, without any hesitation, walked forward without hesitation. After arriving at the side of the phoenix-tailed cocktail snake, Song went on also made a decisive move, just grabbed the neck of the phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake. Immediately after, Carrying a thousand-pound phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake, Song Wentong placed it firmly under Meng Still's feet. Later, Song Wentong also spoke to Meng Still, kill it, take the ring, and absorb it. Upon hearing his brother Song Wentong's words, after nodding affirmatively, Meng Still made a decisive decision and took out the iron-cutting dagger, ready to strike the dying phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake with the final blow. Seeing this scene, Seeing Meng still about to kill the phoenix-tailed cocktail snake, Oscar also became anxious at once. He spoke with a tone full of anxiety, Teacher Zhao, boss Dai. My soul ring. The phoenix-tailed cocktail snake is a rare and excellent soul ring for Oscar, so he won't give it up until absolutely necessary. As the captain of the Shrek Seven Monsters, as the leader of the Six Brothers and Sisters, my younger brother's soul ring is almost gone, can Dai Mubai watch helplessly or sit idly by? Of course not. So, Dai Mubai stood up decisively. Just listen, Dai Mubai spoke up, he spoke with a resounding and powerful tone, full of energy, if you dare to touch that phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake today, you will not only offend the Seven Treasures Glass sect, but also our star Luo Empire. After speaking, after taking out the Xinglua Prince's decree, Dai Mubai also directly threw it on the ground and showed it to Song Wentong and his team. Seeing that token, after confirming repeatedly that it is true, the snake woman's pupils suddenly shrank and she said, I didn't expect that a small Shrek Academy would be so reclusive. The daughter of the Seven Treasures Glass sect is just among them, and the prince of the Star Luo sect is also inside. It seems that this matter today is troublesome. 
Thinking of this, Snake Lady Kaoshiangxiang couldn't help but feel some worried emotions surging into her heart. Offending the Seven Treasures Glass Sect, at most, I can't survive in the Soul Master Realm, but offending the Star Luo Empire, it's very likely that you won't be able to survive on the entire Dolua continent. However, after the Snake Lady's gaze shifted to her obedient grandson Song went on, her worried emotions and the pressure on her body dissipated and disappeared. As for the Seven Treasures Glass Sect and the Star Luo Empire, she immediately disregarded it. When her obedient grandson Song went on grows up, that must be the first divine residence in the Dolua continent for 20,000 years, at all times, would her snake lady still be afraid of just the Star Luo Empire? Afraid of the Seven Treasures of the Glass Sect. That's right, in the eyes of snake lady Kaoshiangxiang, her grandson Song went on is the future divine mansion. Upon hearing Dai Mubai's words, after an obvious look of disdain appeared on his face, Song went on also responded to the voice and said, Joke, can you, a useless prince who escaped from the Star Luo Empire, represent the entire Star Luo Empire? This is really ridiculous, it's a big joke. Shi Ning Rongrong said she can represent the seven treasures of the glass sect, which I believe, but you. You don't have the qualifications yet. Yes, can Dai Mubai, a useless prince who escaped from the Star Empire out of fear, represent the entire Star Empire? Of course not. After hearing these four familiar words, the useless prince, that could no longer be familiar with, Dai Mubai's pupils immediately contracted visibly. There is a saying that goes well, it's called a dragon with scales, it will die if touched. And the four words, useless prince, are Dai Mubai's rebellious scales, now, since Song Wentong has deeply touched and even spoken in front of Zhu Zhuqing, whom Dai Mubai deeply loves, can Dai Mubai, who has good face, bear it? I can't bear it. So after slowly regaining consciousness, Dai Mubai decided to teach Song Wentong a lesson no matter what, and the best thing is to be able to kill it. Can kill all three of his ancestors and grandchildren. The corners of the mouth couldn't help but twitch and then, the expression of resentment hung on the face in an instant, after a yellow centenary soul ring rises from under the feet, without saying a word, Dai Mubai immediately started his hand and said, the first soul skill is the white tiger bodyguard. After the soul skill is released, with a fixed gaze and a locked gaze, Dai Mubai decisively killed Song Wentong. He Dai Mubai wants to see today how much the teacher, Zhao Wuji, who spoke of Song Wentong is not simple, is really not simple. Meanwhile, Dai Mubai hopes that Song Wentong will not be a paper tiger and will not be easily defeated by him. Seeing Dai Mubai take action, Zhao Wuji became anxious in an instant and said, Mu Bai, don't be impulsive. Impulse is the devil. This sentence is not for fun. After Zhao Wuji's words fell, without waiting for him to dissuade Dai Mubai, who shot out like a sharp arrow, Ning Rongrong's powerful voice came to his ears. Seven treasures are famous, one is called strength. Who is Ning Rongrong increasing the growth rate for? Of course, it's for Dai Mubai. Just now, her seven treasures glass Miss Ning Rongrong has already spoken, she said that the phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake, Ning Rongrong, will definitely win, but what about Song Wentong? He doesn't know what to do, but he still dares to snatch it. So, like Dai Mubai, Ning Rongrong had to teach her a lesson no matter what, to make her understand that the Seven Treasures Glass sect was not easy to deal with, and her Ning Rongrong was a small family power like Song Wentong that could never be offended. A star Luo Prince Dai Mubai took action, a Seven Treasures Qianjin Ning Rongrong takes action, this also caused Zhao Wuji to feel a bit overwhelmed for a moment. In the end, Zhao Wuji wisely chose to stand by and observe the changes, plotting before taking action. For Dai Mubai, who came head dot on with a fierce aura, Song Wentong also summoned his martial soul to listen to the wind blade. At the moment when the wind blade appeared in Song Wentong's hand, the six soul rings of yellow, yellow, purple, black, and black also rose one by one from under his feet. Moment Shrek's crowd was all dumbfounded and Dai Mubai, who had already made a move, was also stunned on the spot. 
In his twenties, the six ring soul emperor. And. And his fourth soul ring is also a ten thousand year level soul ring. So, I'm afraid it's not a commotion, what about playing? If it weren't for the fluctuation of soul power and the pressure of soul rings, that crowd would never believe that this could be said to be a shocking scene before them. Teacher Zhao's words are not false. This guy is really not simple. After such an idea popped up in his mind and he couldn't help but swallow his saliva, Dai Mubai also felt uneasy, fearful, and cold. What is it for him to challenge a six-ring soul emperor with a three-ring soul lord? Isn't it just that the old birthday star is getting tired of eating arsenic? Genius! Absolute genius! We must make him used by my seven treasures glass sect. Looking at the six soul rings under Song Wentong's feet, after confirming their accuracy multiple times, Ning Rongrong secretly thought to himself. At the same time, his whole body also became excited and excited. At most, an ordinary person in their twenties is just a soul sect, if one can reach the soul king, they will be one in a million geniuses, and what about Song Wentong? In his twenties, he achieved the soul emperor, and even his fourth soul ring was a perpetual soul ring that only the soul king could possess. So, Song Wentong is definitely a genius, and he is still a genius among geniuses. And if these characters are used by his seven treasure glass sect, it is very likely to make his seven treasure glass sect a powerful existence of the three Dolua in the future. So for a moment, Ning Rongrong couldn't help but have the idea of taking Song Wentong into his pocket and using it for his own use. Just, will Song Wentong really submit to her as Ning Rongrong wishes? Of course not. Name. Song Wentong, First Martial Soul. Listening to the Wind Blade, a precious sword with the ultimate wind attribute that can absorb the power of other elements for personal use. Yellow, yellow, purple, black, black. Second Martial Soul. Swallowing Dragon Python, as long as you devour soul beasts, you can get upgraded soul rings by matching their soul rings, black 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 red. Soul Power Level. 69. Soul Bone Matching. 100,000 years of external soul bone with dragon wings, gifted by Gushin system. Nurturing Gu Bu, Diamond Heart Gu, Bamboo Gentleman Gu, Winged Gu, Iron Skin Gu, Copper Skin Gu, Angry Wine Gu. Item Equipment. 1 External Soul Bone, 8 Spider Spears, 3 Immortal Grass Plants. Other Items and Equipment Vary. P.S. Online Search for Recommended Tickets, Monthly Tickets. New Book Period, Requires Support. End of this Chapter. Chapter 3. Killing the Immovable Ming King Zhao Wuji and the Voice of Ning Rongrong. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 3. Killing the Immortal Ming King Zhao Wuji, the Voice of Ning Rongrong. Seeking Support. Who is Song Wentong? He is the owner of Twin Martial Souls. He is a genius with innate soul power. It's a system traveler. He is the only Gu master who knows all the secrets of Dolua continent. So, will he join the Seven Treasures and Glass sect, submit to the Blue Electric Tyrannosaurus Rex family, and submit to the Martial Soul Hall, Houtian sect, or the two empires of the Star Luo Heavenly Do? Of course not. The reason for not knowing it is also very simple, it's not because these forces don't deserve him to join Song Wentong. And at most, there is only a possibility of cooperation between them and Song Wentong. Just as everyone at the scene fell into a shocked silence due to Song Wentong's amazing soul power level and incredible soul ring combination, Ning Rongrong spoke proudly and said, Fengwei cocktail snake can be given to you. How about we talk about other things, such as joining my seven treasures glass sect. When speaking these words, Ning Rongrong had an obvious expression of confidence on his face, it is obvious that she is determined to recruit Song Wentong. After Ning Rongrong finished speaking, Song Wentong couldn't help but feel a bit ridiculous, give him the phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake, Song Wentong. Does Ning Rongrong have the face to say such things? 
After all, if no snake Lady Kaoshiangxiang had discovered and injured this phoenix-tailed cocktail snake, would she rather be honored? Can Shrek Academy easily capture the phoenix-tailed cocktail snake? Definitely not, isn't it? In summary, Ning Rongrong's face is really thicker than the city wall, bullets can't penetrate it. Upon hearing this, Song Wentong spoke up and gave a resounding and powerful response with a strong and energetic tone, saying, this phoenix-tailed coxcomb snake was found by my mother. In law. What face do you have and what qualifications do you have to say, let go? Also, join your seven treasure glass sect. Do you also deserve your seven treasure glass sect? After speaking, without waiting for Ning Rongrong to give a response, as Song Wentong's gaze shifted to Zhao Wuji, he also activated his own soul power and said, Just now, you had a killing intent on my mother. In law and my sister, right? Have a murderous intent towards his Song Wentong's mother. In law and sister. In Tang San's words, doesn't this mean there is already a way to take death? That's why today's Zhao Wuji, who never dies, has to be abandoned here. After Song Wen finished the call, Zhao Wuji was immediately dumbfounded. At the same time, Zhao Wuji never expected that Song Wen Tong would observe so carefully, even his careful thoughts and small ideas just now could be clearly seen through. And such observation power is really a bit terrifying. Just as Zhao Wuji was about to speak a lie, by the way, provide a reasonable explanation, so that the conflict between the two sides will not continue to deepen, Song went on, however, without saying a word, directly started to move his hand. Song Wentong's speed was very fast, like a ghost that came and went without a trace. When Zhao Wuji smelled a strong sense of crisis and confirmed that Song Wentong had taken action against him, he was also surprised to find that Song Wentong had already killed him. In an instant, Zhao Wuji's pupils suddenly shrank and his face suddenly changed. His heart was suddenly startled and he said, How fast? Is he a sole master of the Quick Attack series? Such an idea, while occupying the brain, Zhao Wuji, who reacted very quickly, also made some corresponding counterattacks or defenses immediately. The third soul skill, Gravity Enhancement. Gravity Enhancement, as the name suggests, it means enhancing gravity, after using this soul skill on people, it will make them feel trapped in a quagmire and make them feel like walking on thin ice, making it difficult to move. Currently, this soul skill is perfect for dealing with quick attack soul masters, like Song Wentong. Suddenly, Zhao Wuji felt a slight uncomfortable coolness in his neck, and Zhao Wuji instinctively lowered his head to take a glance, his heart was also filled with a strong sense of despair, and at the same time, an incredible shock appeared on his face. I saw a terrifying wound on Zhao Wuji's neck, about the length of a palm, and at the wound, there was a constant stream of crimson blood rushing out from it. Soon, Zhao Wuji, who had lost too much blood, felt a wave of dizziness, next, Zhao Wuji felt his body gradually becoming weak and powerless. Three seconds later, with a loud bang, Zhao Wuji fell to the ground. From then on, Zhao Wuji, nicknamed the Immovable Ming King, died and completely fell here. When I die, Zhao Wuji widened his eyes, he has a very obvious expression of not closing his eyes in death. Zhao Wuji couldn't even calculate that he would die in the hands of a younger generation, not to mention a soul emperor. Moreover, he was solved by the opponent's move. Meanwhile, on the other side. Ah cut one sound is thinking, two sounds are cursing, so who is thinking of me? Is it Erlong? After a big sneeze, the four-eyed owl Fran spoke up. When speaking these words, he had a very obvious cheap smile on his face. After easily solving the problem of the immovable Ming King Zhao Wuji, Song Wentong shifted his gaze to Dai Mubai. Song Wentong vaguely remembers, just now, Dai Mubai wanted to kill him, I even want to kill Meng Still and Snake Lady Chao Tian Xiang behind him, Song Wentong's handling of this is very simple, which is to directly eliminate Dai Mubai and prevent future troubles. As for releasing the tiger back to the mountain and sparing Dai Mubai. Sorry, Song Wentong can't do it. At the moment when Song Wentong was staring at him, 
Daimubai's whole body trembled with fear, after swallowing uncontrollably, his body couldn't help but tremble. Teacher Zhao is also a soul saint. But. But he solved it with one move, so. Is he still human? As I thought to myself, Dai Mubai also regretted offending Song went on, at the same time, he regretted that he had been ungrateful and ignorant at the beginning. On the side, after seeing Song went on effortlessly and effortlessly kill the immovable Ming King Zhao Wuji, Ning Rongrong also fell silent and witty. At present, Ning Rongrong has no bodyguards or guardians by her side, so she understands that she must not offend Song went on at this time, let alone provoke him at all, otherwise, if Song went on really takes action against her, no one can keep her. Ning Rongrong is spicy and domineering, but she is not foolish. On the contrary, she is also very intelligent, acting according to the situation and judging people's faces. Otherwise, she would not have been labeled as a ghost in the original work. You are so ignorant that you dare to refuse my invitation and insult my seven treasures glass sect. Then when I return to the sect, I will definitely have Sword Grandpa Bone Grandpa personally kill you and destroy your entire clan. If it's not used by my seven treasures glass sect, then it's useless to keep you. A genius who cannot grow up is just a genius. Looking at Psalm went on, Ning Rongrong secretly thought to himself, but at the same time, he also made the decision to kill Song went on and annihilate the entire Song went on clan. At this point, Song went on opened his mouth and said with a smile, I didn't expect that the eldest lady of the Seven Treasures Glass sect would be so cruel and ruthless, so rich and inhumane. She even wanted the two titled Dolua crown servants to kill me and destroy my entire clan after returning. In that case, I'm sorry Miss Ning. Today, this place is your burial ground. After all, there is a saying that goes, a gentleman does not stand under a dangerous wall, does he? Ning Rong Rong. Dot. After Song Wen finished the call, Ning Rong Rong was also stunned and stunned on the spot, she thought in Ning Rong Rong's heart, how did Song Went On know? How did Song Went On learn about Ning Rong Rong's inner thoughts? The answer to this question is very simple, he learned it through Gu. There are millions of types of Gu, there are also millions of effects, there is a type of Gu insect that allows users to hear the voices of others, and this type of Gu insect is called Jishin Gu. Just a moment before it caught everyone's eye on the scene, Song went on used the heartfelt Gu to everyone. End of this chapter Chapter 4 Punish Ning Rongrong with the Diamond Heart Gu turning seven monsters into five monsters. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 4 Punish Ning Rongrong with the Diamond Heart Gu, Seven Monsters Become Five Monsters, Seeking Support. Apart from the heartwarming Gu, Song Went On also used many other types of poisonous insects to the people at Shrek Academy. As for what kind of poisonous insects there are, we won't explain them one by one for now. Ning Rongrong looked at Song Went On, her incredulous expression was obvious and difficult to conceal, in Ning Rongrong's beautiful eyes, apart from fear and unease, there was only fear and apprehension left. Afraid Ning Rongrong is rarely afraid, after all, there are two titled Dolua warriors with sword bones fighting against her, so she didn't have much fear in the Seven Treasures Glass sect or even in the entire Dolua continent, but now, Ning Rongrong was actually afraid and still deeply afraid. There is no other reason, just because Song Went On is so terrifying. Can you actually hear what others are thinking? So, is Song Went On still a person? You. Can you. Can you hear what I'm thinking in my heart? Ning Rongrong trembled and spoke up, subconsciously asking Song Went On a question. And as soon as she said this, Ning Rongrong regretted it immediately. After all, she made it clear that Song Went On was not wrong when she said this. At the same time, it also proves that she really had the idea of killing Song Went On and annihilating the Song Went On family, right? At this moment, Ning Rongrong was panicked and lost in what to do, she swore that she had never been so panicked or chaotic before, and all of this is because of that mysterious Song Went On. 
whether it's possible or not is not important. What's important is that you really have that idea and mindset, right? After Song went on smiled lightly and said these words, he decisively killed him, who was using his inner soul power. For Song went on, who was approaching with a fierce and lightning fast momentum, Ning Rongrong, who was completely powerless to resist, could only close his eyes in despair, Ning Rongrong understands that no one can save him at this moment, meanwhile, today is the time of her death, Ning Rongrong. After three breaths, Ning Rongrong felt that nothing had happened afterwards, she also slowly opened her eyes, at the moment when he opened his eyes, Ning Rongrong sat on the ground in shock. In front of Ning Rongrong was a knife, a knife that cut iron like mud, blue hair and broke hair, while Song went on was holding the knife and looking at her. Open your mouth. Song went on spoke with a cold tone. As he spoke, he pressed down the knife in his hand, which brought it closer to Ning Rongrong's tender and white skin. Regarding this, where would Ning Rongrong dare to slack off? Without any hesitation, she quickly opened her mouth with an, ah, sound. On the side, seeing this scene, seeing Ning Rongrong, whom he had been longing for, being so bullied by Song went on, Oscar, who claimed to specialize in sausages, felt extremely angry, nevertheless, but he also dared not act rashly, after all, Zhao Wuji, who was enemies of Song went on, was already dead and was killed with just one move. So how dare he be a demon at this time? Who dares to oppose Song went on at this time? In front of everyone, Song went on fed Ning Rongrong a worm, which was neither big nor small, green. The worm had a pair of sharp teeth, as if it could bite through everything in the world. You. Feed me insects. After the insect entered, Ning Rongrong reacted and felt a wave of nausea on her face. Feed her Ning Rongrong insects. Is Song went on afraid of being abnormal? She would rather be honored than suffer such a great shame. Treat her. If she manages to survive, she will inevitably seek revenge. Forget it, Ning Rongrong dare not think, as he is afraid that his voice will be heard by Song went on again. It is obvious that Ning Rongrong is really afraid of Song went on, only then did she dare not even have the idea of retaliating against Song went on. Looking at Ning Rongrong, after Song went on smiled for the first time, he also said, This is a good thing. I won't give it to anyone without certain qualifications. The insect just now is called the Diamond Heart Goo, it is a powerful goo insect refined from heart and diamond, and people without a certain identity are really not worthy of eating this thing. After Song went on finished speaking, he snapped his finger and conducted a corresponding experiment. With a loud bang, a heart-wrenching and chilling scream came from Ning Rongrong's mouth, ah. When she spoke, Ning Rongrong's eyes turned white and her face was grim. She lay on the ground, tightly covering her chest with both hands. She looked as embarrassed as possible, and as miserable as possible. Diamond goo is a type of goo that can make life worse than death, once this goo is activated, it will cause a heart-wrenching pain, and those who can withstand this pain, as far as we can see, do not yet exist in the Dolua continent. Even Song went on himself is difficult to bear, it's hard to bear. Seeing that Ning Rongrong was about to succumb to the excruciating pain from the piercing goo and pass out, Song went on snapped his finger again. After the snap of a finger, like escaping from death, like resurrection from death, Ning Rongrong also just lay down on the ground. Upon seeing this, Song went on spoke up, kneel down, don't lie down. Make Ning Rongrong comfortable. Enjoy lying down. Song went on can't do it. Upon hearing Song Wentong's words, forced by helplessness, Ning Rongrong had to struggle to get up from the ground and then knelt down steadily and lost in front of Song Wentong. At this moment, Ning Rongrong no longer has the demeanor of Miss Seven Treasures, arrogant, all she had was a tortured and scared appearance and posture. The terrifying and powerful nature of the heart-piercing Gu, Ning Rongrong cannot describe it in words, she only knew that feeling was really worse than death, not to mention it even more unbearable than dying directly, hundreds, thousands of times. Overall, 
she really doesn't want to taste such unbearable pain anymore, so for Song Wentong's orders, Ning Rongrong generally won't refuse, only execute, only agree, and accept. Rongrong Seeing Rongrong, a good sisters, being tortured like this, Rogue Rabbit Xiaowu felt a little weird, and her eyes on Song Wentong changed. At this moment, in Xiaowu's eyes, Song Wentong is the devil, a real devil. After solving by Ningrong Rongrong, Song Wentong shifted his focus to Ma Hongjun and Oscar. At the moment of being targeted by Song Wentong, Oscar and Ma Hongjun were like sheep being targeted by a fierce tiger, instantly trembling with fear and trembling with fear. At the first moment of reflection, Ma Hongjun also immediately spoke up and wittily said, I eat insects. After Ma Hongjun finished speaking, his head fell to the ground with a thud. Then, Song Wentong's voice rang out, I said, not everyone is qualified to eat that good thing. Want to eat diamond heart goo to save your life. Ma Hongjun doesn't have this qualification yet. After solving Ma Hongjun's problem, Song Wentong, whose knife was already stained with crimson blood, made another move and directly attacked Oscar. Bang bang, Oscar's head falls to the ground. From then on, the Shrek 7 became the Shrek 5. Seeing that Oscar and Ma Hongjun were both dead, a sense of happiness immediately surged into Ning Rongrong's heart. It's okay, fortunately, she ate worms, otherwise, otherwise, she will be gone. Third, fight with him. Seeing his good brother's successive tragic deaths and downfall, Dai Mubai also made a decisive decision and prepared to make his final move. At this moment, no bow, ten deaths without life. Iba, a close call to death. Okay. After Tang San uttered this word as a response, he took advantage of Dai Mubai's killing and immediately ran away with the ghost shadow and little dance. That's right, Tang San has run away. Leaving the green mountains behind is not afraid of not having firewood to burn, Tang San also understands this truth. For Tang San's behavior, Dai Mubai only wanted to say, Ah minus. P.S. Readers who feel that this book is quite good can vote for free recommendation and monthly support. Thank you so much. End of this chapter. Chapter 5 The King of the Forest Appears, Song Went On vs. Titan Ape, Seeking. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 5 the King of the Forest appears, Song went on versus Titan Ape, seeking support. Seeing Tang San running away with Xiao Wu, with a fixed gaze and a locked gaze, Song went on also pursued and killed without hesitation. Want to escape from Song Wentong's hands. Idiotic delusions. With the help of the increase in speed of the soul listening wind blade, Song went on easily caught up with Tang San and Xiao Wu. After blocking the way in front of the two, or in other words, the road ahead, Song Wentong also spoke up and said with a resounding and powerful tone, If you run away again, I will make your two lives worse than death. After the sound of Song Wen's conversation fell, Tang San and Xiao Wu stopped very wisely and dared not act recklessly anymore. On the surface, Tang San dared not act rashly anymore, but actually. Tang San, on the other hand, was prepared with hidden weapons and even aimed at Song Wentong. Tang San is not someone who sits idly by, and until absolutely necessary, he won't give up either. As long as Tang San can survive today, he will definitely retaliate fiercely against Song Wentong in the future. At the same time, in Tang San's eyes, Song Wentong, the guy who harmed his Tang San brothers, also has a way to die. As Song Wentong approached step by step, Tang San is ready to strike a crucial moment with a silent sleeve arrow, a deafening roar that echoed through the sky exploded like thunder in the spring rain. The next moment, a huge object caught Tang San's eye, looking at the huge creature with a figure resembling a small mountain, Tang San Yi couldn't help but lose his composure. That's right, the titan ape, known as the king of the forest, has arrived. It actually appeared in the outer area of the starry forest. Although I don't know why the forest king titan ape appeared in the peripheral area, in short, it was Tang Sanming's situation that became even more complicated. 
At the critical moment when Tang San was stunned by the appearance of the Titan Ape, Song Wenhong quickly killed him like a ghost. Taking advantage of your illness and taking your life, Song Wenhong is such a person. How dare you be distracted on the battlefield? This really has you, Tang San. At the moment Song Wenhong killed him, Tang San immediately sensed a sense of crisis and realized something was wrong. When Tang San realized it, one of his arms had already fallen to the ground. That's right, Tang San's arm was cut off by Song Wentong. What arm did Tang San break off? The answer to the question is very simple, he broke his left arm. For a soul master, breaking his left arm is not a big problem, after all, the martial soul is on his right hand. However, for Tang San, breaking his left arm means breaking his future path, just because his Haotian hammer martial soul is on his left arm, or in other words, on his left hand. Third brother. Seeing Tang San break his arm, Xiao Wu couldn't help feeling heartbroken. As she spoke, there were obvious tears swirling in her eyes. After slowly regaining consciousness, as my breathing became rapid, Xiao Wu also spoke loudly and said, Erming, help me kill that damn human. I want him to be broken into countless pieces. I want him to be cut to pieces, I want him to die hard. When Xiaowu spoke these words, her eyes were crimson, and at the same time, her murderous, hateful, and angry expressions were visible to the naked eye. That's right, in order to avenge Tang San's broken arm, her little dance decisively exposed her identity. Today, if you don't kill Song Wentong, Xiaowu vows not to be human. Wait, does Xiaowu seem like she's not human from the beginning? Since that's the case, then her little dance vows not to be a rabbit. After receiving Xiaowu's command, the Titan Ape shifted its gaze to Song Wentong, and without any hesitation, it also acted decisively. Seeing that Xiaowu actually ordered the Forest King Titan Ape, and after the Forest King Titan Ape obediently followed suit, Tang San was also at a loss on the spot. The great king of the forest, the titan ape, actually obeyed the command of Little Dance, who was just a great soul master. Xiaowu, Shi. Xiaowu, how can she be virtuous and capable? Is it possible? Is it possible that there is some unknown secret between the two of them? In a moment, Tang San, who never expected or dared not, felt that his worldview had collapsed. For the majestic forest king titan ape, who is coming towards us, after an obvious smile appeared on his face, Song Wentong also came straight to confront him head dot on. Directly welcomed the Titan Ape. That's right, it's a frontal confrontation. Song Wentong faced the Titan Ape head dot on. Song Wentong is just a soul emperor, he dares to confront the king of the forest, the Titan Ape. Not to mention anything else, his courage alone is enough to shake the world and stand tall among the heroes. Dragon Power Gu Elephant Power Gu After using these two Gu insects that pressed the bottom of the box, Song Wentong's power also skyrocketed in the blink of an eye. The dragon in water has the greatest strength, while the elephant in land has the highest strength, the functions of these two Gu insects are very simple, that is to make Song Wentong's power soar and skyrocket. The Titan Ape is good at power, so Song Wentong plays with it. He actually had a tough encounter with the Titan Ape. Has he gone crazy? On the side, when she saw Song Wentong facing the king of the forest, the Titan Ape, she just didn't back down, and even went against the trend and killed him. To be honest, Zhu Zhu Qing was also shocked and shocked by his behavior and actions. She secretly thought to herself, but at the same time, she also looked at Song Wentong with new eyes. Such a powerful man, first time meeting Zhu Zhu Qing. Human, confront me head dot on. You're really looking for death. Seeing Song Wentong killing him head dot on, the Titan Ape also felt disdain in its heart. It spoke with a tone full of sarcasm. Looking at the entire Doloa continent, Dare to play hard against the Titan Ape, Song Wentong is the first person in history. And this also made the Titan Ape unable to help but have some interest in Song Wentong, this tiny human. 
After a loud bang exploded, the titan ape's huge, bull-like fist also collided with Song Wentong's fist, with this punch, Song Wentong flew backwards, with this punch, the titan ape took a few steps back in its body shape. Erming was dismissed. Seeing this scene, Xiao Wu was immediately dumbfounded. She lived with the Erming titan ape for tens of thousands of years, so how could she not know the strength and prowess of the Erming titan ape? In her impression, let's not talk about repelling the Erming Titan Ape for now, there are very few soul beasts and humans who can compete with the Erming Titan Ape, but now, Xiao Wu saw that Erming Titan Ape had been kicked back by someone, without saying anything, even. Even the person who repelled it was just a soul emperor. So, how did Song went on, that damn guy who killed a thousand knives, actually do it? The name, Titan Ape's strongest power is a soul beast, truly lives up to its reputation. I use dragon power goo and elephant power goo to barely catch up with its power. It seems that this battle can be fought happily. Song went on, who was knocked upside down and flew out, calmed down for a moment, and his smile became even brighter. He was also prepared to spare no effort and give it his all. Today, he Song went on wants to break through the realm of soul saint. Today, he Song went on wants to obtain a 100,000 year soul ring. Human beings, surprisingly able to repel me, I have to say, you are very good. But today, you will undoubtedly die. Titan Kong changes. Feeling a tingling and painful hand, the Titan ape spoke up and praised Song went on. After praising it, it also made another move, and this time the Titan ape used a skill of amplification type. From then on, a huge gap in strength led to a great war. Seeing that the situation was not good, Snake Lady Chao Tian Xiang quickly suppressed Zhu Zhuqing in Dai Mubai, and led her granddaughter Meng to retreat. P.S. Looking for recommended tickets, monthly tickets. Thank you for your support. End of this chapter. Chapter 6 Song Wentong's Death, Successful Breakthrough of Soul Saint, Titan Ape Stupid you are listening at NovelFull.Audio. Chapter 6 Song went on dies, successfully breaks through Soul Saint, Titan Ape Stupid Eyes, Seeking Support. Boom. Boom. Boom boom boom. After a fierce battle, the Titan Ape, known as the King of the Forest and with a cultivation period of 100,000 years, was also exhausted and panting. Its opponent, Song went on, was also seriously injured and his life was on the line. Under normal circumstances, the Titan Ape can solve a Soul Emperor with up to three punches, but dealing with Song went on, the Titan Ape, however, took a quarter of an hour to barely injure and inflict heavy damage. Meanwhile, the Titan Ape couldn't figure out one thing, that's because the humans in front of us are just a mere Soul Emperor, but why is the strength so strong that it can be on par with some title Dolo? Although we don't know how the humans in front of us did it, the Titan Ape understands that it's time to end all of this. Human beings, if we give you another twenty years, you will surely grow into the dream of countless humans titled Doluo Realm. At all times, I will not be your opponent. At the same time, there will definitely be no soul beast that can rival you in the entire star forest. But there is no such thing in this world, and today will also be your death. After speaking, with a fixed gaze and a locked gaze, the Titan Ape, which had activated its internal energy, released its innate skill. Titan Ape Cannon At the moment when this cannon shot out like a sharp arrow, the earth around the Titan Ape immediately cracked, and not only that, but also the air and space shook. The Titan Ape Cannon, under the title Dolua, one will undoubtedly die. Even the band Dolua dare not confront it head dot on. Here we go. In the eyes of others, the powerful shot of the Titan Ape is a danger, a fatal danger. However, in the eyes of Song Went Ong, who was seriously injured, this shot is a chance, a great opportunity, which can allow him to break through and become a Soul Saint powerhouse in one fell swoop. The first soul skill, Endless Devouring. After switching the martial soul from the original wind listening blade to the current swallowing python, 
a huge python immediately appeared behind Song Wentong, as a dark and dazzling perpetual soul ring rose from the bottom of his feet in circulation. At the moment when the python appeared, it immediately opened its bloody mouth, at the same time, the python also took advantage of the situation and swallowed the titan ape's cannon into its mouth. That's right, Song Wentong ate the titan ape cannon, he didn't choose to dodge, nor did he choose to defend. He once again faced the forest king titan ape head dot on. Seeing this scene, the titan ape couldn't help but sneer and speak, how dare you forcefully take on my titan ape cannon. You are truly a human who knows nothing about the world. Do you really think that after a few fights with me, you can be my opponent? It's ridiculous. Are you trying to devour my titan ape cannon? I have to say, your courage is worthy of the admiration of the king of this forest. Seeing this scene, after seeing Song went on eat the titan ape cannon, Zhu Zhuqin couldn't help but feel regretful and said, take the full blow from the titan ape with force. It seems he's dead, Sai. The genius of humanity fell into the hands of soul beasts, and Zhu Zhuqin felt sad and unworthy for it. After Zhu Zhuqin finished speaking, she also let out a heavy sigh. Compared to Zhu Zhuqing's loss and sadness, Dai Mubai, who saw Song Wentong eat the titan ape cannon, was full of excitement and said, he's dead. He's dead. This despicable guy is finally going to die. Dai Mu finished speaking in plain language, a snake staff, without any warning, struck his good brother with lightning speed, at the moment when my good brother was critically attacked, Dai Mubai's face also turned pale in an instant, at the same time, his facial expression was also directly stiff, not only that, the intense pain caused by the critical strike also directly left Dai Mubai with tears of happiness. Dai Mubai can guarantee that this will inevitably cause him to lose his future happiness. Meanwhile, on the other side. Alas, why are all the eggs broken? None is good. I want to make laver egg vegetable soup. Looking at the broken eggs in the chicken coop for some unknown reason, Frand, the four-eyed owl, also had a puzzled and puzzled expression on his face. It goes without saying that the person who attacked Dai Mubai was Meng Still, the sister of Song Wentong. After giving Dai Mubai a fierce move, Meng Still spoke up in anger and said, My brother can't die. Close your stinky mouth. After Meng's words fell, a deafening explosion followed closely from the inside of the giant python, after the explosion disappeared, after the smoke generated by the explosion slowly dissipated, a huge hole also appeared in the place where Song Wentong was located, the hole is very deep, very big, and there is a person inside. The person lying on the ground has no breath and no vitality. That person is not anyone else, it is Song Wentong, who is naked in his upper body. After confirming repeatedly that Song Wentong is already dead and cannot die again, after a hint of disdain and arrogance hung on his face, the titan ape gave a contemptuous glance, but at the same time, it also opened its mouth and said, Oppose me. Die at all costs. Upon hearing the words of the titan ape, Xiaowu's eyes lit up instantly and her heart was filled with joy, surprisingly daring to harm her beloved third brother, that despicable song went on is really damn it. Unfortunately, it's too cheap to let him die. Later, Shi Xiaowu wants to go up and whip the corpse, torment Song Wentong's body, otherwise, it would be difficult to dispel the hatred in her little dance sister's heart. After solving Song Wentong's problem, the titan ape shifted its gaze and attention to the distant snake which Xiang Xiang and Meng still, and strangely enough, it is clear that Song Wentong has already died, but snake lady Meng remained as if nothing had happened, and there was no hint of sadness in their faces or expressions. After noticing this, the titan ape also vaguely sensed something was wrong, when it shifted its gaze back into the deep pit, it suddenly realized that Song Wentong, who had already fainted and had been lying there just now, had disappeared and no longer existed. Dead, gone. Where is it? Fake a corpse. In an instant, the titan ape panicked. At this critical moment, Song Wentong's voice rang out, Gorilla, I'll give you two choices. Looking for the sound to ring, the titan ape saw Song Wentong intact, 
saw Tang San kneeling on the ground, and saw Xiao Wu being pinched by Song Wentong's neck. After repeatedly confirming that I didn't make a mistake, the Titan Ape was also a dumbfounded and bewildered monk, when it spoke, its tone became noticeably flustered and disorganized, what situation? What situation? You. You're dead, aren't you? You. How could you? How could you become like nothing is the same? Say too, what situation, in a row, it can be seen that the Titan Ape is currently lost and at a loss. At this moment, the Titan Ape discovered a problem, which was that Song Wentong had actually reached the realm of Soul Saint. From dead to living, the soul power level has also been increased, so how did Song Wentong do it? Also, is Song Wentong really still human? Song Wentong was indeed dead just now, but he didn't die completely. Meteorously spawning goo, a species of countless poisonous insects, the function of this goo insect is very simple, that is to enable people to obtain an immortal body. End of this chapter. Chapter 7 Meteorite and Poison, Two Choices, Threatening Titan Ape, Seeking You are listening at Novel Full Audio. Chapter 7 Meteorous Insects, Two Choices, Threatening Titan Apes, Seeking Support Meteorously spawning goo, it is one of the countless goo insects, at the same time, it is also one of the top tier among the countless goo insects, meteorite-born goo can be achieved by feeding it with its own flesh and blood for decades. During the ten years of refining this goo, one's life would be more difficult than death. After refining it, as long as the goo does not die, then one can remain immortal. And once goo dies, people will die. And Song Wentong has mastered this goo. At the same time, he also used a secret technique to make Song Wentong unable to die even if this goo died. In summary, in the present Dot De Dolua continent, no one can kill him, Song Wentong. Don't talk about people, even if it's a god, it's difficult to kill Song Wentong. Gorilla, there are two options. You should consider them carefully. When Song Wentong spoke these words, he also extended two fingers to show the Titan Ape, at the same time, on Song Wentong's handsome and charming face, there was also a very obvious expression of interest and playfulness. At this moment, the Titan Ape dared not act recklessly, after all, the neck of its beloved little dancer was tightly choked by Song Wentong. Song Wentong could come back to life from death, but his little dancer could not. Therefore, for a moment, the Titan Ape had to stay in place and observe the changes, to see what Song Wentong really wanted to do. He actually. He's still alive. I, I didn't see it wrong, did I? What's the situation? Looking at Song Wentong, who was completely unscathed, after repeatedly confirming that he had not made a mistake, to be honest, Zhu Zhu Qing was also unable to handle it on the spot. The explosion just now, under the title Dolua, one will undoubtedly die, therefore, the reason is not to mention Song Wentong, who was already seriously injured, but now. Song Wentong, however, appeared before Zhu Zhu Qing's eyes with nothing to say, and even. He successfully caught Xiao Wu to threaten the forest king, the Titan Ape. So, what exactly is this situation? Is Song Wentong a monster? Also, why is the Titan Ape threatened due to its small dance, is it possible that there is some unknown relationship or secret between the two of them? He's not a human, he's a monster. He's a monster. Dai Mubai, who was in a state of extreme physical and psychological pain, couldn't help but think of this idea in his mind after seeing Song Wentong unscathed. At this moment, Dai Mubai understands, Song Wentong is not someone he can offend himself, as for the reason. It's also very simple. Because he is invincible to the Titan Ape, the king of the hard steel forest, and can become a soul emperor powerhouse at the age of twenty, allowing the fourth soul reign to reach the level of ten thousand years, these reasons, take out anyone you want, don't even talk about him wearing Mubai, even the entire starry empire doesn't want to offend. After all, this kind of existence, in the future, 
it can be said that it is also the highest strength at the Dolua level. I said my brother can't die. After seeing Song Wentong's peaceful appearance in front of his eyes, Meng still spoke happily and proudly. My brother's secret, Meng still knows more or less about it. Just listen, Song Wentong spoke up, he spoke with a resounding and powerful tone, full of energy, choose one, she dies and becomes my seventh soul ring. Option two, if you sacrifice to me, I will spare her life. Either way, Song Wentong can obtain a 100,000 year soul ring in his seventh soul ring. Human, how dare you? You have ideas about my soul ring. After listening to what Song Wentong was saying, the titan ape also instantly became furious. It opened its mouth, and its eyes were filled with killing intent, with visible anger. The titan ape has finished speaking, while Song Wentong's face showed displeasure, he also frowned and replied, don't be arrogant and domineering in front of me, I'm not satisfied with your temperament, understand. If you have the ability, just kill me. If you don't have the ability, just make a choice obediently. I'll give you ten breaths of time. After ten breaths, if you don't sacrifice, I'll kill her. At that time, I'll run away. Don't think you can keep me or kill me, after all, if I can resurrect once, I can resurrect twice, three times, ten times, a hundred times. After speaking, Song went on exerted a slight force on his right hand, and Xiaowu's face turned red from being pinched, gradually feeling suffocated. Upon hearing what Song Wentong had said, while Xiaowu was having difficulty breathing, she also stirred up a huge uproar in her heart, he. Isn't he the soul emperor? So. How did he know that I was a transformed soul beast? This guy. Is really terrifying. Who the hell is he? In general, only the title Dolua, only then can we peek through her Xiaowu true body, isn't Song Wentong just a soul emperor? So how did he see through her true identity as Xiaowu? 10. Song Wentong uttered a word with a serious and serious expression on his face. Erming. Kill. Kill him. Xiaowu spoke, her gaze fixed on the titan ape. 6. Song Wentong spoke again, his right hand exerting a slight force once again. Zhu Zhu Qing. Dot. Dai Mubai said, What? Xiao Wu Tang San. Dot. It is obvious that the six people on site after Song went on were all dumbfounded and confused. Humans, isn't it nine after ten? Do you think I, the Titan Ape, haven't read a book? No, what if I haven't read a book? Can't I count yet? The Titan Ape spoke up feeling that his intelligence had been seriously insulted. 4. Ignoring the roar of the titan ape and the astonishment of the crowd at the scene, Song went on only continued the countdown. At this moment, the titan ape understands, the person in front of me is just an unreasonable person, and whatever number he says, that's what number is, and after counting, Xiao Wu's life is really dangerous. Xiao Wu, it is the white moonlight in the heart of the titan ape, for Xiao Wu, the titan ape can sacrifice its life, for this reason, between Xiao Wu and himself, the titan ape unconsciously chose Xiao Wu. I offer a sacrifice. But you have to promise me that after this is done, you cannot harm Xiao Wu's hair. 3. Song Wentong still hasn't replied, in his opinion, verbal effort is not as good as practical action. Air. Air. Air Ming. No. Xiao Wu wanted to advise the titan ape not to sacrifice, but before she could finish speaking, Song went on, whose eyes were fixed and his eyes locked, knocked her unconscious with a knife. Seeing Xiao Wu knocked unconscious, as Tang San knelt on the ground and extended his hand, he muttered to himself, Xiao. Xiao Wu. Get lost. Looking at Tang San's outstretched hand, as Song went on uttered this word, he also directly rewarded Tang San with a kick, the latter directly flew backwards as a result. P.S. New book period, seeking recommended tickets, monthly tickets. Thank you to all the readers for their support. End of this chapter. Chapter 8
Song went on achieve Soul Saint, the first 100,000 year soul ring. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 8 Song went on achieve Soul Saint, first 100,000 year soul ring, seeking support. In no time, in order to preserve the little dance that I have been longing for, the Titan Ape began its sacrifice. I didn't expect that during my lifetime, Zhu Zhu Qin would be able to see scenes of soul beasts sacrificing for 100,000 years. Even if I die today, I don't think I'm at a loss. When speaking these words, Zhu Zhu Qin's beautiful eyes were fixed on the Titan Ape, the king of the forest, whose body was like a small mountain, with a straight and hooked gaze. At this moment, Zhu Zhu Qin really doesn't want to miss every minute and every second of the sacrificial scene, because this kind of scene is too rare, and many people may not see it in their lifetime. Zhu Zhu Qin is also very fortunate to have seen it today due to the reason of Song Went Ong. A hundred thousand years of soul beast sacrifice is enough, surprisingly, the one sacrificing is still the forest king of the starry forest. So today's Zhu Zhu Qin is really lucky for three lives. On the side, watching the Titan Ape's body gradually turn red with blood, watching the Titan Ape's breath of life gradually dissipate, Dai Mubai felt like crying uncontrollably, he couldn't help but feel despair and regret in his heart, the seventh soul ring is 100,000 years. What kind of existence have I offended? Thinking of this, Dai Mubai wished he could find a piece of tofu to kill himself. Later generations are to be feared. The seventh soul ring is the 100,000 year soul ring that countless people have dreamed of. In terms of soul ring matching, my grandson Went Ong should be the first person in the history of mainland China, right? And he said, there is no such thing as no one before or after. As Song Went Ong began to receive the crimson soul ring that was in circulation for 100,000 years, the snake lady spoke up to the heavenly fragrance with an obvious smile on her wrinkled old face. Youth surpasses blue and surpasses blue, this is what every elder wants to see and is willing to see. After a long time, when a crimson soul ring of 100,000 years rose from under Song Wentong's feet, it represented the end and conclusion of this sacrifice. Feeling the changes that have occurred within oneself, feeling the powerful power contained within oneself, after a satisfied expression of enjoyment hung on his face, Song went on couldn't help but speak up and say, is this the gift brought by the 100,000 year soul ring? The strength of the body, the spiritual power stored in the mind, and the soul power contained in the body have all experienced a leap in growth. It has to be said that this feeling is really enjoyable. Now, I think it's not an exaggeration to say that I am invincible under the title Dolua, right? Soul masters who absorb soul rings can receive feedback and gifts, absorbing soul rings for ten years, a hundred years, and a thousand years can provide physical and soul power feedback and gifts, absorbing soul rings that last for thousands or even hundreds of thousands of years can provide spiritual, physical, and spiritual nourishment and gifts. Combined with the self-nurtured Gu insect, Song Wentong is invincible under the title Dolua, he can even fight against the title Dolua and even the peak Dolua. Brother. Congratulations. After seeing Song Wentong successfully absorb the soul ring of the Titan Ape for 100,000 years, his sister Meng immediately ran over and congratulated him. After nodding slightly and touching Meng's still small head, Song Wentong also replied, Brother's soul ring has been absorbed. Why don't you go and absorb your soul ring too? After absorbing it, when you completely break through and become a soul master at the soul master level, brother has something good to reward you with. When you hear these three words, good things, Meng still had two bright eyes and a happy heart in an instant, and as soon as she realized it, she also absorbed the millennium soul ring produced by the phoenix-tailed cocktail snake without hesitation. Just now, because of the great battle between Song Wentong and the Titan Ape, causing her Meng to still not absorb her soul rings, and now, she can finally absorb soul rings with peace of mind. Name Song Wentong, First Martial Soul Listening to the Wind Blade, Yellow Yellow Purple Black 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 Red, Second Martial Soul Swallowing Dragon Python, Black 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 Red, 
Soul Power Level Level 75, Soul Bone Matching Soul Bone with Dragon Wings for 100,000 Years, Nurturing Goo Boo, Diamond Heart Goo, Bamboo Gentleman Goo, Winged Goo, Iron Skin Goo, Copper Skin Goo, Angry Wine Goo, Dragon Power Goo, Elephant Power Goo. Item Equipment 1 External Soul Bone, 8 Spider Spears, 3 Immortal Grass Plants. Other items and equipment vary. 10 lines at a glance, after reading my current information introduction, Song Wuntong's heart was also very happy and satisfied. A 100,000-year soul ring directly increased his soul power by 5 levels, saving him countless years of hard work. And this can only be said in one word, it's great. The 100,000-year-old soul bone, the wings of the dragon, and three immortal herbs were all gifted to Song Wentong by the Gu God system, these things have never been taken out by Song Wentong from beginning to end, the reason why he didn't take these things out is also very simple, because there is a saying that goes, Pifu is innocent and blames others. Only Song Wentong has achieved a certain level of strength, he will only take out these good things for use. As for the eight spider spears with external soul bones. It was obtained by Song Wentong by beheading the killer face demon spider. Tang San's chance is that Song Wentong won't take it for nothing. After solving the forest king titan monkey, Song Wentong shifted his gaze back to Tang San, Xiao Wu, Dai Mubai, Zhu Zhu Qing, and Ning Rongrong. Seeing Song Wentong sweep his gaze towards him, Feelings of fear and chills instantly surged in my heart, Ning Rongrong also lowered his head without hesitation and without hesitation. At present, Ning Rongrong dare not look at the devilish man like Song Wentong, after all, the other party's terrifying and terrifying methods are still remembered by Ning Rongrong, and he deeply understands them. Recalling Song Wentong's crimson 100,000-year soul ring, after involuntarily swallowing saliva, Ning Rongrong also whispered in his heart, if. If he were to grow up, then. Then. Even if Grandpa Sword and Grandpa Bone were combined, they wouldn't be as good as him, right? After all. After all, his seventh soul ring is a 100,000 year soul skill, and. Grandpa Sword and Grandpa Bone don't have any 100,000 year soul rings. Thinking of this, for Song went on, this despicable and annoying guy, Ning Rongrong couldn't help but show respect and reverence. For the strong, the weak always worship, and Ning Rongrong is no exception. Ning Rongrong had already eaten the heart-piercing goo that would cause unbearable pain and make life worse than death. In addition, there was a heart-piercing goo in her body, so Song Wentong will not take care of her for a short time, and now, Song Wentong is responsible for managing a Tang San and a Dai Mubai, as for Xiao Wu. It has been prepared by Song Wentong as his eighth soul ring for listening to the Wind Blade Martial Soul. End of this chapter. Chapter 9 The Use of Tang San, The Use of Xiao Wu, and Meng Still's Award. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 9 The Use of Tang San, The Use of Xiao Wu, and Meng Still's reward, seeking support. After the sacrifice of the Titan Ape, without any hesitation, Song Wentong also decisively took its body in the 100,000-year-old soul bone it produced into his bag. The value of a 100,000-year soul bone is self.evident, therefore, it is very normal for Song Wentong to keep it in his pocket, but why did Song Wentong still take away the body of the Titan Ape? The answer to this question is very simple, because Song Wentong wants to use the corpse of the Titan Ape to practice Gu, to practice Titan Gu. Titan Gu is a type of Gu insect that can significantly increase and enhance one's strength, speed, defense, explosive power, and reaction power. If this Gu insect is successfully refined, it would be like an additional trump card for Song Wentong. It is precisely for this reason that Song Wentong took away its body. Being able to become my Gu Bu is also a blessing in your life. Fortunately, the storage soul weapon gifted by the Gu Shen system to Song went on was large enough, otherwise he wouldn't have been able to take away the body of the Titan Ape. Seeing that Song Wentong is so despicable, not even willing to release the body of the Erming Titan Ape, 
the little dance, clenching her fists and gritting her teeth, was also quite angry. A pair of fierce eyes stared fixedly at Song Went On, looking at Xiao Wu's expression as if he wished to cut Song Went On to pieces. It seems to have sensed the killing intent from Xiao Wu, with a fixed gaze and a locked gaze, with an obvious displeasure on his face, Song Went On walked straight toward Xiao Wu and at the same time, he spoke up, saying, You don't agree with me. Xiao Wu didn't hesitate about this, and she replied unwillingly, I'm not convinced. If you have the ability, you can kill me. Do you want to taste the pain that girl named Rongrong has suffered? Seeing Xiao Wu's stubbornness, to be honest, Song Went On also became interested. He spoke, and his displeasure gradually turned into an interested smile. Regarding this, after a disdainful expression hung on his face, Xiao Wu also spoke fearlessly and said, Just taste it. Who's afraid of anyone? I'll tell you, if you kill Erming, I won't let you go. You'd better kill me directly. Otherwise, I'll make sure you're doomed. There's no place to bury you. After Xiao Wu's words fell, Song Wentong's listening wind blade slashed towards Tang San on the side. After a loud bang, Tang San dropped a finger on the spot. What are you doing? Seeing Song went on attacking Tang San, she was completely fearless just now, and a small dance with a fearless expression immediately panicked. What am I doing? Bullying him, you're not convinced, Song went on replied with a nonchalant expression. Dealing with people who are completely fearless, dealing with upright and unyielding people, dealing with people who are not afraid of life and death, then you can't touch him himself, you have to touch the people, things, or things he cares about. This is not, Song went on and Tang San, who Xiao Wu was concerned about, took action, Xiao Wu also directly disrupted her movements, didn't she? Not afraid of death. Then I won't let you die. Not afraid of pain. Then I won't let you hurt. But as long as you have something that you care about or have weaknesses, Song Went On will focus on the things that you care about, specifically on your fatal weaknesses. And this is the best way to deal with enemies since ancient times. Now, if you still don't agree, then I'll have to chop off Tang San's right arm, Song Went On said after placing the Ting Fong knife in his hand on Tang San's right arm, seeing that Song Went On was actually threatening her with Tang San whom she had been longing for, even if Xiao Wu didn't accept it anymore, at this moment, she had to bow down to Song Went On and say, I. I accept it. That's right, that's right. After saying these words, Song Went On swung his sword again and chopped off Tang San Yi's finger. This is the punishment for your previous disobedience to me. At this moment, Tang San can be said to be wanting to cry without tears, it was clearly her little dance that caused the trouble, but. Why should it be counted on Tang San's head? Dan Xiaowu, he's really a big loser. And the pain that connects ten fingers to one's heart really lives up to its reputation. Let's eat it. Putting two heart-piercing goo in front of Tang San and Xiao Wu, Song Went On also spoke seriously and seriously. Xiao Wu, it is the eighth soul ring of Song Went On, so, in the short term, Song Went On will not touch him. As for the agreement with the Titan Ape. Even if the apes are dead, why not follow the rules? Song Went On at most showed his compassion, allowing Xiao Wu to live for a while longer. People are not for themselves, heaven and earth will perish. Tang San, Song Went On won't move either, he will use it to make a good deal, and this deal can give Song Went On a chance to become a god. Maximizing benefits, it is Song Wentong's principle of doing things. Tang San Xiaowu, a pair of unfortunate mandarin ducks, exchanged a glance at the two green and worn dot out poisonous insects given by Song Wentong. In the end, they reluctantly chose to eat them and struggled to swallow them into their stomachs. Not eating, there's a dead end. So, they have to eat. Seeing that both Xiaowu and Tang San had eaten the heart piercing goo, Song went on nodded in great satisfaction and then came to Zhu Zhu Qing in Dai Mubai. Please give me a hearty pleasure, Your Excellency. After seeing Song went on approaching and swallowing in fear, Zhu Zhu Qing also spoke in a pleading tone. 
It is obvious that Zhu Zhuqing accepted his fate. After listening to what Zhu Zhuqing was saying and looking at her twice, Song Wentong ignored her and walked straight past her. When he arrived at Dai Mubai's face, Dai Mubai also hurriedly opened his mouth and said, I eat insects. I eat. It is obvious that Dai Mubai does not want to die yet, he is very willing to sacrifice his life. However, it seems that Dai Mubai is also a prince, a presence above 10,000 people. With just a wave of his hand, countless yellow and white objects or power beauties beckon to him, and twins are something he likes to play with. Therefore, it is normal for him not to want to die and to enjoy life well. Open your mouth, Song Wentong said, looking at him arrogantly. When he spoke, Song Wentong's eyes had a disdain and playfulness that ordinary people couldn't detect. Ah! Upon hearing the words, open mouth, Dai Mubai opened his mouth without hesitation, as if a hungry dog had seen tender meat. At the same time, a smile immediately appeared on Dai Mubai's face. As long as he eats the insects, then Dai Mubai's life can be saved. The heavens and the earth are vast, and Dai Mubai's life is the greatest. The next moment, Dai Mubai's head fell to the ground. Heart piercing goo, do you wear Mubai to go with it? It's almost enough to train you into a heart piercing goo. From then on, the Shrek 7 monsters became the Shrek 4 monsters. After solving everything, Song went on rested and rested in place. When his sister Meng still absorbed the soul ring, he would leave the star forest. Soon, Meng still absorbed her third soul ring, after successfully becoming a soul master at the soul master level, Meng still immediately came to Song went on to demand a reward. Brother, my reward. Regarding this, Song went on did not grind or chirp, he handed the so dot called reward directly to his sister Meng still. P.S. New book, we need the strong support of all readers and masters. We are looking for recommended tickets and monthly tickets online. Thank you very much. Of course, if you could offer some rewards, cannons would be even more sought after. End of this chapter. Chapter 10 The Three Rewards of Song Went On and Meng Separation. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 10 Three Rewards of Song Went On, Breaking Away from Meng Still, Seeking Support. Song Went On gave his sister Meng Still three rewards, and from the Storage Soul Guide, Song Went On first took out one of the rewards. Looking at the sparkling bones in Song Wentong's hand and feeling the energy contained within them, Meng couldn't help but brighten his eyes. At the same time, he still opened his mouth with a joyful expression and said, Brother, is this? This a soul bone. Soul bone, it is a priceless treasure, it is a valuable but not marketable treasure, but Meng still never expected, nor dared he, that his brother Song Wentong would actually give her a soul bone as a reward, so, her brother, really bold. Upon hearing Meng's words, Song Wentong did not respond, he only transmitted the message in secret, carefully and cautiously answering his inquiry. This is an external soul bone, not an ordinary soul bone. Try not to reveal it when there is nothing important in daily life, after all, there is a saying that goes, wealth is not revealed, isn't it? That's right, Song went on gave the eight spider spears with outer soul bones to Meng Still. You should know that Song went on already has the 100,000 year old external soul boning long wing gifted by the system. It is precisely for this reason or other reasons that the eight spider spears with external soul bones are of little use to him, and if left in his hand, it will only be a waste, so, Song went on naturally gave it to his sister Meng Still. Just one sister, who dotes on Song went on if he doesn't favor him. Who will take care of Song went on if he doesn't take care of him? At the moment of hearing the four words, possessed soul bone, the joyful light in Meng Still's beautiful eyes disappeared and no longer existed. What replaced it was astonishment and shock. What is an external soul bone? It is the first bone under the soul bone of 100,000 years. It is the second existence on the soul master dream list. It is something second only to a 100,000 year soul ring and a 100,000 year soul bone. 
And now? Now her brother Song went on has handed it over to her, Meng still. This made Meng still feel somewhat flattered for a moment. No, no, no. After slowly regaining consciousness, Meng shook his head subconsciously. At the same time, he also immediately spoke up and repeatedly praised it back. This is too precious. Brother, please keep it for use, I can't take it. The gift from the elder is irresistible, and besides, your brother and I have other external soul bones. After Song went on finished his transmission, he couldn't refuse and directly snatched the stored soul guide from Meng Still's waist, then stuffed the eight spider spears of the soul bones into it. Helpless, Meng Still had to accept the first reward given by Song went on. Be good, soul bones as a reward. My dad doesn't treat me so well either. Looking at the scene before him, after repeatedly confirming that he had not made a mistake, Ning Rongrong couldn't help but mutter to himself. In Ning Rongrong's view, Song went on should be the first person in terms of rewards and rewards throughout history. Rewards from others are not just yellow and white items, but also identity rights and so on, what about Song went on? He's fine, he just gave a soul bone. Overall, in just one sentence, Song Wentong's arrogance is soaring. The second reward given by Song Wentong to his sister Meng still is a few gubu, including the elephant power goo that can greatly increase strength, the sharp-tailed swallow goo that can increase speed and gain flight ability, and the face goo that can permanently maintain one's current appearance. While handing over these goo insects to Meng still, Song Wentong also opened his mouth to introduce its function and usefulness. Forever maintain the current appearance of Gu, I believe there is no woman who doesn't like it, right? And in order to obtain such a Gu insect, Song Wentong also put in a lot of effort and effort. The meaning is that I won't become ugly or old in the future. Can I always be what I am now? Thank you, brother. I love you so much. As expected, after obtaining the beauty Gu, after learning about its function and characteristics, Meng still suddenly became extremely excited and joyful. In an extremely excited and excited state, Meng continued to pounce at Song Wentong in front of her, wanting to kiss her cheek as a gesture of gratitude. However, it was a pity that Song Wentong did not give her the opportunity, so Song Wentong dodged in a flash. At the same time, Meng was still not tall enough, and even standing on tiptoe, it was difficult to kiss Song went on. On the side, after listening to the dialogue and exchange between Song went on and Meng still, after learning about the amazing effect of the beauty goo on humans and humans, and its usefulness, kneeling on the ground, Ning Rongrong's heart immediately stirred up an unprecedented uproar, goo bug. What is that? Always maintaining its current appearance. Really? Really fake? If it's true, then if that bug is taken out, it will definitely shake the entire soul master world and even the entire Dolua continent. After all, no woman would want that kind of bug. Ning Rongrong is the daughter of Ning Fengji, who is not only the first auxiliary soul master in mainland China, but also the first businessman in mainland China. Therefore, Ning Rongrong also has some understanding and knowledge of the shopping and business world. That's why, Ning Rongrong is well aware of the value and importance of that goo insect. On the side, listening to the communication between Song Wentong and Meng Still, Tang San's eyes couldn't help but surge with shock, surprise, and amazement. While his gaze was fixed on Song Wentong, the murderous hatred in his heart also grew stronger. Don't forget, Tang San is a traveler, it's a person from Tangmen in western Sichuan, in the world where Tang San was originally located, since there were hidden weapons, poisons, internal mental skills, and so on, there were naturally Gu. Meanwhile, in Tang San's eyes, the Gu masters who control Gu insects are not good people, and Gu Shir is also a guy with a way to take death. Finally, it was Song Wentong who gave Meng still the third reward for breaking through and becoming the Soul Lord. This reward was a frog, of course, more precisely, it was something stored inside the frog. The frog is called the big-bellied frog and is a type of insect that can be used to store things, 
and the thing inside the big-bellied frog was the third reward given to Meng still by Song Wentong, as for what's inside. That's unknown. Here, there is your reward, as well as the gift I gave to my mother. In law and grandfather. Remember, when you return to the family, you are watching, and at the same time, no one else should know. After handing over the big bellied frog to Meng Still, Song Wentong also specially conveyed a message of instruction. Upon hearing Song Wentong's words, the wise Meng Still didn't know that there must be something good inside, a good treasure and it was very likely that it was a treasure that surpassed the external soul bone. So when she realized this, she immediately spoke up and replied seriously and seriously, I'll do it. After giving Meng still the reward, Song Wentong parted ways with him and left with Tang San, Ning Rongrong, Xiao Wu, and Zhu Zhu Qin. P.S. Book Friend Group, Interested Readers Can Add One 580,840.4614, end of this chapter.